It's an 89 Yamaha Raz in stylish black. It's more of a classic style. Rachel Struthers is selling it on Craigslist, 600 bucks or best offer. It's got working lights, a strong motor. There's nothing wrong with it, just the body needs a little bit picking up, but it runs just like it was perfectly new. And while it's not part of her pitch, mopeds like this have a special South Carolina feature. They're immune to DUI, something this Spartanburg lawmaker wanted to challenge. It's a DUI loophole. That's the only thing that I'm concerned about. According to South Carolina law, officers can only charge for DUI if a person is operating a motor vehicle. But the legal definition of motor vehicle exempts these. It literally says, except mopeds. And when Eddie Talon introduced a bill to close the loophole, it stalled. It did not pass. Um, so Why, why we can't a bill like that get through the state house? If I knew the answer to that question, I'd be running this country. Uh, <laughs> the rules in Columbia allow a single senator to be a roadblock for legislation. So the moped loophole sat in the Senate from May of 2011 until the session ended a full year later. After passing the state house, the bill never came up for a vote in the Senate. And now Talon and another Spartanburg lawmaker will try again, giving officers another enforcement tool. Although in this case, the existing laws. They're easy to use. and. I don't have a uh, driver's license yet. Would be enough.